Well, howdy people, how are ya? Well, this is a video that kind of follows up from my last video, My Inner Thoughts. And I was kind of thinking, like, you know, as you do with an imagination, that I'm actually on a merry-go-round I never really asked to be on. And it seems I can't get off. I've become a third, maybe fourth-class citizen in my own country. All the media is for femons. All the papers is about femons. Any movies out there are about femons. Then it's no wonder that a lot of men are just femoned out. But at least we're still free, right? Wrong. Can you go and say what you want? Nope. It's kind of like, say for instance, you're walking along the street and a femon's walking the other way and you say hello to her. Is that okay? Nope. The police will probably come. That sure as hell don't sound like a free place to me. So these other countries that are circling because they're not all woked up and are strong, would it really be all that bad being taken over by another country? A stronger one. And years and years ago that would be unthinkable, but nowadays, you know, I'm thinking about it myself. Just in my imagination, of course, as you know, is quite vivid. And the way I see it, there's only really two contenders that can take over. And I think we both know which ones they are. That's a big R and there's a big C. Actually, the big C is a place in Thailand, actually. Big shopping mall. Of course, there is another scenario when the big C and the big R actually get together. I can see that happening, too. But which one would be better, in my mind, to be taken over by? Now, I had a friend who uh, used to live in the Big C. In fact, he was from the Big C. And he told me some stories, and they were pretty scary, really. But, of course, the Big R isn't much better, because it's like the wild, wild west there, isn't it? I mean, they have a car accident there in the Big R, and they all get their AK-47s out. <laughs> I guess that's their, kind of their insurance companies, I guess. So for me anyway, out of the two evils, I guess, it would be the big R. I mean, at least you get a free AK-47, I suppose. Anyway, that's just my imagination put into words. So how about your imagination, guys? What do you think?